My name is Dennis Schaller, and I'm an undergraduate research assistant in the Department of Psychology under Dr. Mark West. I work for Professor Keaton, who's the faculty director of Oresti. Um, I'm a physics major, but most of the work I've been doing has been in astronomy. So the research project that I worked on um, my freshman year of summer was cancer biology related. My project is within the humanities kind of field. We are studying the effects of public relations um, campaigns on public opinion surrounding oil, most, more specifically the Keystone XL pipeline running from Canada to the Gulf of the US. I've been studying the effect of a phenomenon called gravitational lensing on objects in space. And gravitational lensing is the idea that mass can bend light. I worked on the BRCA1 gene, which when there's mutations in that gene, it usually leads to breast cancer or hereditary ovarian cancer. We study brain activity and affected behavior in rats during cocaine self-administration. We're trying to figure out how um, different public relations techniques sway public opinion so that, I don't know, certain policies can be put into place. So when you have two objects in space that are aligned and they're light emitting objects, so as an example, if you have two galaxies perfectly aligned and then Earth as an observer is also aligned in that system, the light from the background object kind of bends around the foreground object and it distorts the images that we see. Human drug addiction is a widespread societal problem and we think that if you can pinpoint the behavioral, the neural, and the electrophysiological basis of addiction, then we may be able to make advances as to what is plaguing the you know, subset of the population that becomes chronic drug abusers. What you get to do through this program is by really understanding what it is that you're working on on a daily basis and um, how to frame your research in a way that other people can understand, you're really giving them the ability to communicate effectively to any audience.